Hey folks, it's Frithgar here, how you doing? Welcome back to Transport Fever 2. Now I don't think building a harbour here is going to be enough. So we're going to, as we're going to want a bridge coming across the river, we're also going to be wanting um, trucks transporting the stuff from here anyway. Uh, we will go with a harbour. We'll take a passenger, we'll take a cargo harbour and we will put that one right there. Close to Bucharest. And then we will... I'm not going to worry about doing any more of that bit. That one can stop. And then I will go here to the Bucharest East District Annex. And we will configure this one. So we want to go to cargo over here. And we want to go to the dock bit. So that one goes there, and that one goes there. Now, is that going to be enough? Yes, that one can go on there, and that one can go on there. So I've got two landing um, strips for ships over there. I think that is going to work out very nicely. And we can get rid of you now, and you can go. And then I can go in here, and I can take just regular street right there. And that's going to join in there like that. Just connect that bit together got our big one-way system going over there so the next thing that i want to do is i actually want to have four lane roads coming down here because this is going to be something a bit bigger so i will put four lane on there we've got a little bit of a loop here with the four lane stuff and then i can go back to this one and i can put four lane on there like that actually i'm gonna want that one because you're gonna come out of there Like that. It's going to go over there like that. That's going to upgrade to four lane. I'm going to take this and it's going to go there. And that's going to connect in there. So I've got a little bit of a loop on this with the four lane stuff. Uh, that one can go... No, actually I'm going to leave that as two lane and that's going to go across there like that. So I've got a smaller route out this way if I want it. But I've got that there. I've got the harbour is now connected up. Which I think is a good thing. And then out this side. You know, we'll put the bridge We'll put the bridge over this way. Which means I do actually want four lane, four lane and four lane over to there. Because i got plans for this four lane road. Right. That's four. And... That's four lanes as well. Okay, so we've got a whole load of four lane stuff over there. Then out of this, we will go back this way over to here. And I'll take that four lane right there. I will take straight line road. That's going to go to here. And I'm actually going to bring that up like that. And then I want to go over... Actually, I'm just going to leave that there. And then I want to go over to this side. Is that going straight? Yeah, that, that is going straight. So we, we kind of want to come over to here. Somewhere like that. And I want to build that bit there. Now, what I've actually gone and done is I've done that the wrong way round. So I want to bring that one over to there like that. Now, is that... I want you going in that kind of straight line over there. That's going where it needs to be between the two. That's a lot steeper there than it is over this side. Then I take the two of them and I join them together like this. We take that sort of bridge. And they should, I'm hoping, be high enough. Like that. If we need to extend this out at all. I'm hoping that those two there will be high enough to do everything that they need to do. And then I can bring this one out over here. We want to change that over to that, like that. I actually want this to be like this. So you can come over this way, there, and that one can join in onto there, like that. So I've got four lane road going over to here. Might be beneficial, might not be. I don't think I can upgrade that without collisions and i don't think it really matters anyway that would probably be just as good without having it as four lanes so we, we we're not going to worry about it at all what i am going to do is not do that refund that one 
Yeah, get rid of that. And then I want to go to you. I want to spin you round and I want to put you on there like that. That's where you're going to go. You're going to have two platforms each side and you're going to be 30 meter platforms. You're going to go like that. That's where that one's going to go. And we're going to have trucks running over to there. Then this one down here. I'm going to put another one of these and that's going to go directly opposite the harbour. That's going to go into there. I may... Well, we can always change the configuration of that one in a little bit. So we've got that bit over there. Then this over this side, we've got... That one's kind of working already, but I, I need to do the trucks bit. Or I've got to have... No, we'll do we'll do that all with ships. We'll do, we'll, this whole thing's going to be done with ships. Over here. Trucks are going to start up over on this side. And we're also going to have buses over this side as well. So we need to set up some buses. We've got to set up a bus terminal. So I'm going to go into here. And this is going to be the big bus terminal that we're going to build for our city. And that's going to go right in there like that. It's the perfect spot for a bus terminal right in there. And then we can go with bus tram stop. So I got one bus tram stop that is going to go over here. And that one is going to go on there. It's actually going to go that side of the road like that. And I'm going to go into streets over here. I'm going to take the two lane road there. That one is going to go straight round there. Like Why is that collision? Oh, that's a... Right, we, we, we've got a building site right there. I need to bring you over this way. I don't want to do that. You go there like that. Take that one over to there. Right. There. I've got a loop going around that. There's a building site there. I don't know what that building site is. I've absolutely no clue, but I'm sure we'll find out. But we've got a road that loops around it so that we've got our bus stop in there that we'll be able to use. And we've got that one over here. Then we want to go to buildings and we want to go to bus tram stops in here. And we need to set up some bus routes going around this city. This is this is a big old city, this one is. So we need to put... Let's see, where, where are we going to put this? We, we got that. I don't need to worry about that one. So I'm going to put my first bus stop right there. And if it's on that side, it means that the traffic is going to probably be better off heading over this side. Put one here. And then we've got these roads extending out. We'll put one there. We'll go over this side. Go up there and put one in. One over here. Uh, put one down there, I think. Now we've got to use the one-way system. So we will put one in here. One up there on that part of the one-way system. One down over here like this. Another one over here somewhere. Like that. So it's still making use of this one-way system. And then I've got another one that's coming down this way. Actually, that one can just go there, and then it will go back into the bus stop over here. So we can then go with a line manager in here, and we can go with a new line. So the first line that I want to make is going to be one from Upper Bucharest East District over to Bucharest East District Transfer. Then I got another line that's going to go from the bus stop over there to that one over there. It's just going to go up there and turn around, despite my loop that I carefully went and built. And then I'm going to take another one. And this one here is going to go to North Road. It's then going to go to Mill Road. Uh, it's going to go to George Street. And it's going to go to West Street. And it's going to go to North Street as well. And then I'm going to take another new line. And this one here is also going to go to North Road. And it's going to skip that station. 
going to go from there. It's going to go up to Park Avenue. No, it's not. I'll go to that road. North Road up to West Street. Park Avenue. School Lane. New Street. I've got too many stops over here. Way too many stops. Uh, Church Street can go. We will get rid of Church Street. And we'll have Highfield Road. York Road. North Street. So I've, I've got too many stops over here. There are too many. So we're going to want to get rid of New Street. Definitely. That one's got to go. Take that one out. And I would say School Lane has got to go as well. Remove the school lane stop. So I got West... No, actually, remove the Park Avenue stop. Take that one out. West Street. After that, we then go over to school lane. Like that. Down to Queen's Road, and then that comes down through this way. So we can remove that stop there. And this stop over here. Refund those two. Let's go back into the line manager. Which other ones have we got? There's also New Street in there. That one needs to go. I'll get rid of that one there. Refund that one. Okay. Uh, no, I don't want streets. I want those. That is the line set how I want. So I've got two loops running through Bucharest. And then I've also got one loop that runs over here and goes back again. And then I've got one truck delivery route that's running between here. So the truck delivery route, I would say we're going to want... Uh, what should we say? Six trucks running that route? We'll take six running that route. The buses between here and here, we're going to want three... Three buses. No, two. Only two. And this would be five trucks. Five trucks here and two buses running that one. And then in town, I'm going to want eight on each route. That's what I'm thinking. Eight buses on each route, plus two out here. That makes 18 buses. And then a, a few of the other. That's it. Let's, let's get those in first a minute. Alexandria Road Depot over here where we'll be buying all buses that we will be, well, all vehicles that we will be using. So we'll go in here for our buses. I said I want two to run the main route and then I want six on each of the other routes that we're going to be running as well. If we find that we need more than that, then fine. But at the moment, that means that we've got, uh, no, I said eight running on each route, didn't I? So there's 18 that I want all together. So we want 18 buses in there for 7 million. They're all going to go in. And then I'm also going to want the uh, the, the trucks to go in as well. And we're going to want... Uh, I'm saying five. I, I, will, I will stick with that. I will go with five. And we're going to go with the Universal Man 19304 uh, right here. The top one. Because that does carry absolutely everything so we'll have five of those added to the grand total as well and we will bring them all out so i want first up i want two of these bad boys to go onto this route here which is the purple route pink route so i want two pink buses to go there and they are going to go onto line five then i want eight of these Seven, eight, right there. They're going to go on the orange route, which is that one. And they're going to go out here. They're going to run line six for us. Then we've got the other eight buses here. And those are going to go out on the brown route over here. So we'll color them and send them out. And then I've got five trucks right here. Those going on the blue route, and they're going out there. So they're on to line four. Excellent. Fan Dabby Doozer. That is wonderful. I've got my trains running up here. We've got Gooseman X over there. And down here, I've got Divanj Mahajan. And then we've got our boat running around somewhere. Where is he? Uh, that's Jordan down there. So we're going to want other boats now. I've got to decide how I'm going to do this. I think what I will do is I will have... 
I'm going to have four boats. That's what we'll do. We'll, we'll go in here. We're going to have four of these. And it's going to be these big tankers here. We've got the Viola or we've got that one. It's, it's going to be the Axel. But it's going to be the massive great big tanker here. And I'm going to take four of these. Because we have got long distances that need to be travelled. So there's nine million dollars for those four great big boats right there. Buy them there. Next, I need to create a new line. So we go from here, the Constanza port. We then head over to Galati East. And that's going to be picking up material from here and bringing it over to the Constanza port. And then that's it. We need to then take it from the Constanza port up to the next one. So we go... Actually, no, I don't want to go to Galati East first, do I? I want to go from Constanza port and I want to take the incoming ore. So the first leg of the journey is all the way up to Bucharest. East District Annex all the way up there. And from there, then we come back empty. We come back to this one. We load up here at Galati East with the goods from the oil. And then that is taken over to Constanza Port. So we got three stops en route. We load up here with iron ore. And that gets taken all the way up to Bucharest. And then... From Bucharest, we come back empty, unfortunately, unless we, like, they will probably loop some of it round. They will end up putting some fuel up that way, because they generally do. Um, but, yeah, we will end up coming back empty from Bucharest down to Galati East, where we will load up with goods. And then that's taken over to the port, where we will unload and then load again. So I think that is going to work out all right on there. So there's the big green line on there. I've got to give these... Some names. So we want to go into here and these four need some names a second. So the four boats are Alex, Connor, Talleyrand and The Good Gamer. We'll take those out. They are going on the dark green line. So they will have dark green colorations. And then they will go to line eight like that. So let's get some of these out. The, the buses and everything, they're all going to be running out from the other line. Let's just zoom in a bit here. They do move slowly, don't they? Let's speed that up a little bit, shall we? Right, the good gamer. Let's bring you out over here. I'll zoom him out a little bit like that. And we will bring you round over here. There is Axelp. The good gamer, he's coming in on here. We've only got one port on here, but I don't actually need any more than that. So they will come out, they will queue up. He's going to sit there for a minute, and then he comes out. The next boat is on its way. Why are you going backwards on that? I don't really know. Not that it matters. But there is our fleet of boats. Tally Rand over here. Look at this. we we got a whole fleet of boats down here. I'm loving this. I'm loving that we've got a whole fleet of them actually running here. This is, this is brilliant. This is absolutely fantastic. So they're, they're all having to queue up and wait here for a minute. And then you're off on your way. So we've already got material over here waiting to be brought between the two. Uh, probably that boat is going to have to change things around as well. But um, we will deal with that in the future. Then I want to go over this way. So I've already got a whole load of people waiting at bus stops right the way through this city. I've got a lot of traffic queuing up to get into the city. It's all going on the one-way system, but it's all going on one lane. Why is it all traveling on one lane? They don't seem to want to spread out between lanes. Yeah, use all the lanes. You shouldn't have to tell you this. Use all of the lanes. You wouldn't think it would be that difficult a thing to actually go and do, would you? Okay, so that one in there, we've got a brown bus coming in there. He's, he's going off to do things. Out he goes. We've got more vehicles coming in. What kind is the pink buses that we wanted to wait out for, wasn't it? There, there's some pink ones supposed to be coming in to do this journey over here. Just run up to there. There's only a couple of them. There's not very many. There's one pink bus. And I've got two people on board already. 
Fantastic. Right. These buses coming in here and unloading. They're letting some people out. We've got more people in here waiting now. And there's another pink bus on its way over there. I've got this one just coming up here. And they're unloading people into there who have now come over to the workplace. There we go. Into the steel mill. They're, they're hard at work. They're, they've got stuff to do. We don't yet have any vehicles over here. So, where's our trucks? Do you see the trucks? I think that might be the, the, the trucks are on their way. Oh, no. The trucks are out there queuing to get into this. Goodness me. Look at this. Look at the queues of people waiting to get into this city. This is insane. How are they queuing up so much? It's because of my one-way systems, isn't it? And also the traffic lights. Traffic lights are a bit merciless in here. Like they're, they're all coming in this one... Why are they all coming here? What is so special about this one lane. Why, why do they need to be on this one side? Now they're, sp they're spreading out over there. And the crowd is dispersing a little bit. That's I've kept that bit there as one way, didn't I? Why I kept that as one? It was to try and stop some other traffic coming through, I think. I'm thinking that maybe we should just add in a couple of extra bits down here. Maybe that will help alleviate some of this traffic. I'd like, I'd like to have the traffic alleviated a bit. We, we don't want to have insane traffic everywhere. So if I was to take a road out of there, yes, there's a collision there that is going to remove a building. Do that. Bring that one. Yeah, we'll bring, we'll bring that one out over to there. And that one can go to that point, like that. And you here. No, don't do that. Bring that one on down. Go to this one here. Bring that one on down a little bit further. Go there and put that one out like that. And that's given me an extra little bit of a loop on here. But now suddenly these cars are all using all of the lanes. Oh, you're, you're trying to merge. I've got traffic trying to merge here and trying to do all sorts of weird stuff. I've got those bits. It's now, it's now building out. So I'm going to do the same over here. I'm going to extend out the city a bit more. And I'm going to bring it down to there so that we've got a further city extension. And I'm going to do that to there. And I'm going to extend the city out over this way. It seems to work. Like as soon as you extend the city out a little bit... It does then start trying to fill in all of the little gaps. Like, it's trying to fill in these gaps over here as well. It's added a piece in. So that it's trying to extend it. And I've got a boat up here. Look at this. We've got our first boat up here. There's Connor. He's come all the way up here. He's got nothing on board. And then we've got Alex here. He's got nothing on board. Uh, it's actually not my first boat at all, at all. And then we've got you over here. So they're going to have to go all the way back over here to Galati East. We've got 197 on there. What I need to do is I need to go to you. I need to go line two on here. i got Jordan on here. We need to manage the line. No, I don't. I need to manage the vehicles on line two. I need more people running this line, don't I? We've got 135 in there. Two new vehicles are available. Train and another bus. A bendy bus. We've got a bendy bus. Okay, Jordan, I'm going to... See, I was thinking maybe I need to have more people working here. I've got a lot of oil going that way. Fuel going that way. That's uh, supplying the town over here. Which we, I mean, we do need to do this. We do need to be supplying the town over here. We, we, we've got these 33 oil over here, which are actually working. I've got this up this way. We've got a, uh, I was going to say, I thought that was a train over That's not a train at all. Gooseman over here. How much are you carrying? 
He's carrying 150 barrels of oil right now. He's going to come into the next station. He's going to stop. And he's unloading a load of it. And then he's loading up. Now he's got a full 270 barrels of oil on there. And then he's going to bring his load all the way down over this way. Devanj Mahajan, he's got 60 of those going into there. I think I've got as much oil coming down here as I can possibly get. I don't think I've got any more oil can actually be brought down. Gooseman there. He's, he's got 270. We'll see is if he's full and... We'll check Devanch in a minute once he's turned around and he's come back the other way. If he is also doing exactly the same, I'm going to buy another train and put on this run. Because I think we could do with more oil coming in here. He's going to bring 270 in there. He should unload ev everything now. And then he loads up what he can get of the fuel. 76. He's taking that back the other way. And then I've got Devanch over here. He's got 150 on there, and he's going to come into the next station, and he's not able to take everything with him. He does unload a bit, and he loads back up. Full 270, and I've still got stuff left over. So we're going to go on to that line next, and we're going to... Wait a minute, I want to go here. And I'm going to add in one more train on here. So we'll do exactly the same. I'm not going to replace that vehicle. I'm going to clone that vehicle right there. So I've got another train, and that train is coming out onto the line over here. So you here, you need a new name. We can't just call you Train 1. So you are Patrio Gracemark. Patrio Gracemark there. Is our third train running on that line. I'm down to $50 million. I've got to be aware of the money and it ticking down. So I've got, that one has now dropped down a little bit. And in order to help this out, what I'm also going to do is I'm wondering if it's to do with the amount of traffic that we've got on this particular route right here. So I'm going to duplicate this one here as well. Now he is taking 109 fuel, but I'm hoping with an extra train we'll be bringing in more down this way. And it won't just be like, because at the moment some of it is disappearing up there. I want it to come out to the oil refinery. So if I go to manage vehicle in here, I've got Jordan. He's in good condition. I'm going to clone Jordan right there. So we've got another ship coming in. And you are going to be called Black Wolf 36. Black Wolf right there. Black Wolf uh, 36. He's on his way out. So I've now got two ships working that bit. Going between the two. Plus I've got these ships coming in over here. You got 200, good gamer has got 220 plastics. Connor has got 79 plastics. Alex has got 14 plastics. Tally Rand has got 15. So we've got some plastics coming through. They're going to go into there and get unloaded like that with a boom. And I've got one bit of copper already been swapped over and able to come through on there. And... We're now consuming this, and in place of that, we're bringing out the copper onto the port over here, which is great. So the, the Connor is going to go on in. He's going to take 79 plastic in there, and he's already going to have a whole load of copper that he will then take all the way up to Bucharest, which is going to be absolutely wonderful. We've now transported in enough workers. Those are doing well. The only other thing I've got is this, and I'm actually losing cargo in here because the station is overloaded. So what we're going... Well, unfortunately, folks, that is all we've got time for today. Sometimes even our fantastic pilots, train drivers and lorry drivers and bus drivers and boat drivers and all the other drivers need a little bit of rest. So while they rest up and have a cup of tea... If you've enjoyed the episode, could you please head down below and give us a like? And if you really enjoyed it, then please tell your friends all about me. Get them to come and watch as well. That would be awesome. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. This is Frithgar. Goodbye, and see you later.